Mark Rich joined a small American trading company as an apprentice in the 1950s. He died a billionaire, nicknamed the king of commodities. His success came primarily from oil. He developed the practice of short-term trading, known today as the spot market. But his career was also controversial. He was accused by the United States of sanctions busting. He traded with Iran and with apartheid South Africa. The U.S. also wanted to talk to him about suspected fraud and tax evasion. And in 1983, the FBI placed him on its most wanted list. Mark Rich fled to Switzerland. He avoided extradition and his business thrived. Then in 2001, President Bill Clinton surprisingly pardoned him on his last day in office. The move caused outrage. Critics suggested it was a thank you for generous donations made to the Democratic Party by Rich's wife. Mark Rich, though, never returned to the United States, and a spokesman for his family said he would be buried in Israel on Thursday. Image and Folks, BBC News, Bern.